Good morning, YouTube. If you're new here, my name's Troy, and I live in the middle of Oklahoma. This is one of my dogs, Maple. There's Buck over there. And then we got Layla over here. This is our little dog, dog show. And we got two more American Bullies and a Shit Zoo inside. So, yeah, we're good on dogs. But anyways, it is opening season or starting opening season of dove season in, here in Oklahoma and <clears throat> it's also squirrel season like all year round but I'm gonna try to hold it easy on the squirrels because I already got five in the freezer but yeah we're gonna try to kill some dove today and hopefully we get on them. I'm gonna put y'all on the head mount and we got a nice little ATA arms 12 gauge automatic right here and today we'll be recording on a Hero, GoPro Hero 11 Black with a media mod. And I also picked up this GoPro Hero 9 recently. Um, we already cracked the screen, but it's alright. Because it still looks fine. But um, I'm going to have two POVs in my videos to give you guys, start making better videos. So to give you guys a better view of everything. So I'm going to throw you guys on the head mount and hopefully get on some dove. Hopefully y'all can see everything good. Here's the other GoPro for the second POV, but yeah, this is it. This is where we'll be hunting. It's right along the side of my house, but there's power lines, so hopefully the devil will land on. We're gonna plant some sunflower seeds soon in this field over here, but we haven't really got to it yet. But yeah, anyways, we're gonna get dove hunting. Hopefully we get on. So I got that GoPro recorded and this GoPro recorded. So if we get anything, we're going to see it for sure. And we got our little hunting dog here to guide us through the way as well. So. We got our little hunting dog here to guide us through the way as well. I'm pretty sure I seen a squirrel over here just earlier. So I'll make it over there and try to get it. Also guys, if we see any rabbits, we're going to pop them down as well. Hopefully you guys have a good camera angle. Of action with squirrels in this tree back here. So I'm gonna go see if I can't get one or two. Alright, guys, I'm pretty sure I see a squirrel jump up to this tree. Alright guys, I think we just got one. I'm not sure. Hopefully he didn't run off. But let's see. Oh yeah. Just oh yeah, there he is. We dropped him boys. Alright, he's not all the way out yet, so I'm gonna cut the camera and put this guy out of his misery. And then we'll get back to him whenever he's done for. All 
Alright guys, we got us one squirrel so far. Let's see if we can't get anything else today. So far. Let's see if we can't get nothing else today. These squirrels seem to be moving pretty dang fast. And there's some somebody shooting over here. I hope they don't accidentally shoot me. But let's see what else we can't find running through these trees. I think I just seen a squirrel over here, y'all. Oh yeah. Got him. Wait, no, he ain't down all the way. All right. If that one didn't get him, then I don't know what to say. This is a fighting squirrel. Oh yeah, he's still moving. But he's down. We got him. Just sitting here wasting my bullets. We got two squirrels so far. Maple's carrying our one squirrel for us. Cause she's a good hunting dog. Thank you, Maple. Drop it. Drop it. It's a good, good dog. All right, guys, we got two squirrels so far, and hopefully my GoPro was recording. So, yeah, now we gotta find the GoPro that we dropped and our other squirrel. All right, guys, this may have not been um, a very good dove hunt, but we got two squirrel. I got five squirrel in the freezer. We're sitting out here, it's, it's still pretty early in the morning. <clears throat> It's only 7.50, so we still got enough time to dove hunt. I mean, dove, dove come out all day, but we're probably gonna hunt until around 10 o'clock. And if we don't get any dove, it'll be okay. Um, we're gonna go inside. Uh, we're gonna stay outside, skin the squirrels. We got seven squirrel to skin. And then I'm gonna show y'all how to cook up some good squirrel with some uh, gravy and rice. And it's gonna be a good meal. And we're gonna have a good time, and I'm gonna have a fun time making this video. And if you guys appreciate what I'm doing, just go ahead and drop a like and subscribe. And hope you guys enjoy this video and everything. So, um, yeah, hopefully we catch some dang dove. All right, y'all, this is all the squirrels we got to skin up. We got uh, five, six, seven. We got seven squirrels. And we got to let, let these defrost because I froze them so they're hard. But we can go ahead and skin these. And I'll show you guys how to skin them if YouTube will let me do that. But yeah, you guys are gonna learn how to skin a squirrel. All right, so guys, I've decided that I'm gonna make a separate video of how to skin a squirrel. So if you guys would like to learn how to do that, go over there and watch that. And we're gonna skin up these seven squirrels. But the only reason I'm doing that is because I don't want YouTube to take down this whole bit uh, video for monetization. They can just take out, down that one video. Instead of this um, little uh, killing cook, so we're gonna get these squirrels skinned up. It should be fine, y'all seeing them after they're skinned. And then we're gonna cook them up and we're gonna have dinner. And y'all stay tuned. All right, y'all, so we got all our squirrels here. Got about six or seven, I forgot. But we're gonna go ahead and season them up so that way they can be sitting in the season. So. We're gonna start off with some garlic powder. Just add a healthy amount. Then next, add some onion powder. Then we'll do some paprika. Just do a healthy amount. Then next we'll run in here with some cracked black pepper. Chupacabra seasoning, it's for brisket, but 
It goes pretty good on anything, I think. Now that you've got your squirrel all seasoned up, make sure you put her in, put them in the fridge for about two or three hours to get all that seasoning marinated in. And then we're gonna give them babies a good sear and bake them. And we're gonna add something else to it. It's a surprise. You gotta stay tuned to see it. So you gotta stay tuned and we'll get I'll get back to you whenever the squirrels are done marinating. Alright, so y'all. We got our seasoned squirrel right here. Been marinating in the fridge for a while. We got our pan, so medium heat. And we're gonna get to cooking these squirrels. All right, so first thing you wanna do is put a little bit of vegetable in the bottom of your pan to where it all stick. All right, guys, I should have started my oven before, but uh, turn your oven to 375, um, let it preheat. And this is my cooked squirrel. They're not cooked all the way yet. We're gonna bake them. I'm not sure for how long, but I'll time it and tell you guys how long I cook them for. And then we're gonna cook some stuff to go along with it. That's the surprise you guys have been waiting for. And yeah, my girlfriend's cooking some uh, garlic and parmesan wings and some asian wings that she got going on and that's what we got going right now we're waiting for the oven to preheat and i'll get back to y'all All right, guys, once it starts smelling burnt, starts looking brown, you just take your warm water and you want to slowly pour it in there. That'd be pretty hot. Start stirring. As you pour it in there. Turn your heat down to low. Alright guys, um, whenever you get it all thinned down, you can go ahead and add your beef bouillon. I, add, I like to add a good amount. Not really sure how much, but that's what it actually makes it brown for brown gravy. So, 
Let's get all these in here. Alright y'all, so we got the potatoes going, got the gravy finished, got the wings, got the squirrels down there, they're looking pretty good, they're going to be done soon, but I think with all this, we need a vegetable to go with our dinner, so... Put some corn on the stove and season it up, get it tasted good, and I'll get back to you guys. Alright guys, we got the potatoes done, got the gravy done, got the corn done. The squirrel been in here for about 40 minutes and they are finished. We're finna load our plate up, feast on dinner. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe and Turn that post bell notification on to get more uh, notifications for videos like these. And peace.